We have a couple sad reports on Threadripper, but forget that. Look at the box this thing comes in. L look at it. No, seriously. Look at this thing. Stay tuned. <laughs> Welcome back to GamerMeld. Before we get started, I want to invite everyone to the GamerMeld Discord server. We have some really awesome discussions about all things hardware and gaming. I'll have that linked in the description, so definitely make sure to check it out. Okay, so the first story today has some unfortunate news. Apparently Threadripper may not be coming with a water cooler. In fact, it doesn't seem like it'll come with a cooler of any kind. That's not so great for early adopters looking to get the new 12 or 16 core behemoths because so far, the only cooler that fits the X399 platform that I'm aware of is the newly announced Noctua TR4 coolers. And considering this is pretty much the first AMD HEDT, there is no telling how well it'll sell, so Noctua probably doesn't have the biggest batch upon release. It's this lack of early support that led me to believe an included cooler would probably happen. But according to the same network that reported the initial cooler, they were wrong. Unfortunately, the bad news doesn't stop there, as the same outlet is also reporting that the initially expected pre-orders on July 27th had been cancelled due to the lack of CPUs shipped at launch. And they aren't the only ones hearing Threadripper might not launch with a high number of initial CPUs. Video Cards seems to have heard similar chatter through their channels. Basically, things aren't looking up when it comes to initial release. So if you get a chance to purchase Threadripper and want to, i jump on it. And while speaking about Threadripper's release, it at least looks to still be reported as releasing August 10th, though of course that's not confirmed at the moment. While continuing on the Threadripper train, I do have some really cool news. Originally brought to my attention by the user Save from the GamerMail Discord server, AMD posted the first picture of Threadripper's retail box, and this thing is gorgeous, stunning, sexy. <laughs> I know, these aren't typically adjectives used when people talk about boxes, but if there's ever been a time, it's now. I posted it on Twitter, and it seems most of you agree. Here's another picture with AMD CEO holding it, and it looks just as gorgeous here as well. Lastly, Logitech is offering a pretty substantial discount of $50 off their G900 wireless gaming mouse. It may only be in the US, but definitely let me know if not. Either way, I'm assuming it's to make room for their newer ever-charging line. But it's still one of the best wireless mouse out there for gaming, so check that affiliate link out in the description below. So that ends it for today's video, and while I know it was a little shorter than usual, what did you think about the news? Bummed Threadripper may not come with a cooler after all, or do you just love the box? Let me know in the comments below. That does it for now. If you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe by clicking on the round icon in the middle. You can check out the most recent video and suggested video to the left. Thanks so much for coming, and as always, have a great day.